Okay, I told everybody I was gonna do a review on oh, my direct TV now. Sorry, I was trying to just to show everybody too, just so you know. Hang on, let me connect to the Wi Fi. Phone's having a hard time focusing, but anyways. Look, running off of a Note 4, Hotspot, T Mobile. <laughs> All right, let's get into it. She first initially launched the app. It takes just a second, a few seconds to load, which after that, that's it. Smooth sailing from there, but I like it a lot better than Slang, PlayStation View, and and all the other ones. Video quality's great. And the thing that I, I think that I like the most out of this is the guide, because it's got like a uh, traditional guide look at your channels you know find something that you that you want to watch and then you just oops that's not on right now and then you just click it but see there's other ways to navigate too you can also flip from right to left just like you're switching channels on traditional cable tv too There's National Geographic. And my camera, because the... Matter of fact... Hey, baby, turn that lamp off right there because it's kind of glaring the TV. It ain't doing it no justice. Mm, there we go. That's a little better. Like I said, you can just flip through the channels just like that. Never any problems with streaming, the quality of the picture, or anything. I like it a lot more because they give you a whole lot more options as far as channels go than the other services do. So I'm currently on the $70 package right now just because I like to have a lot of stuff to watch. Even though it seems like no matter how many channels you have, it just seems like there's not even hardly ever anything to watch. But, uh, oh, look, let's see what Fine Bomb's talking about on the SEC Network. I'm a big football guy myself, college football. I don't know about y'all. Oh, commercial break. Oh, there it is. He's back. There's other things that you can do, too, besides that. Now, like, you can go down. You either pull up shows, movies, or you can even pull up networks. You have on demand for every single, every single network that you have in your package. Like, for instance, hold on just a second. Let me go to all. I'll just pick a channel. Title. Season, uh, say Comedy Central. See all their shows and stuff, all the seasons. Uh, you know, all the it's like that for every channel. Most um, and uh, with, uh, the in the for the most part, it works flawlessly. Like watch here, I'll go to a look. There's season nine. Go to one of these episodes of this show. Just click it. Watch now. Takes it just a couple seconds to load up. Then you're ready to go. You're watching TLC on demand. Yep, just like that. Then, if you're going to go back to live TV, you just go back. You click live TV and it takes you back to where you were. 
No DVR yet. DVR is coming this fall, but with all the on-demand content that they got, I don't, I don't know. I don't really need it for the price point. You get more as far as what you pay for with DirecTV now than you do with the others. PlayStation View used to be okay. They went up ten dollars a month on all their packages. And the problem I was having because I was using my hotspot to watch is the fact that. I kept getting these zip code errors because they said that, well, you know, it don't really work right with hotspots because it jumps from tower to tower and blah, blah, blah. Well, none of the other companies do that. Slang TV don't do that either. The only problem I had out of Slang, they had buffering problems and their some of their stuff would be distorted. But there's also, let's see, you can do a search. So you want to search for a show. Like here, here's one of my favorite shows is Power, which comes on stars. Hey, what's up, Paul? We're doing great. Thank you for the call. I want to talk about LSU football today. Why not? Oh, I guess I need to hit the... There we go. Let's see, there it is. Go here. So he pulls up all the seasons. All the episodes for the seasons, too. That way you can catch up on stuff that you're behind on or whatnot. But yeah, I mean, if you hadn't tried DirecTV now, I would. And like when you do try it, they have a code that you can use, a promotional code. When you sign up for it, just type in in all capital letters, Roku, R-O-K-U, the number one, and then month in all caps, M-O-N-T-H. Get it for 30 days for free for your free trial. But anyway, that's just my opinion. But uh, you guys can tell me what you think in the comment section below. And like always, like, share, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys later.